everyone thank you and welcome to my channel um, today I'm gonna do a quick tutorials on how to contour and how to highlight your face I'm gonna do the contour with uh, the pretty and cute palette that I that I have and I bought it from pretty and cute.com I'll link their link down below so you guys can go and check out their products because they have really amazing and gorgeous Asian products and I love the packaging the packaging is super cute um, and this is how it looks like in the inside I dropped my palette recently and and unfortunately this color um, shatters but this is the color that I use to do the couture um, it may seem a bit dark but trust me it goes really really nice on Asian skins um, and perfect for a shadow and it will look also really natural um, I also for the white one I will be using it for highlighting really really good um, I have tried other palettes before but nothing come close to the pretty and cute contour palette um, because the quality of it is super good and the pigmentation is really really good and also easy to blend and work with so um, let's get started and continue to watch if you want to learn how to contour and highlight so um, I'm gonna do the contouring with this brush it's the elf brush and this is how it looks like um, and what you do is that you kinda dab it on this one and then tap off the actuals and apply on your cheek right along your cheekbone underneath right here for um to bring out your cheekbones or if you want to have or if you don't have any um cheekbones and you want to um have a cheekbones a higher one then this is what you would be doing place it right along and put your lips together so you can see where your cheekbone is and know where to put it. I'm going to put it right along here all the way back to my ear right here. Pat it and then bring it down by doing this you can slim down your cheeks if you had um, really round cheeks you know so you can bring it down like this I'm gonna do a little bit dramatic so you guys can um, actually see and bring it up here also okay and go ahead and do the same thing on the other side you see how my cheeks is a lot slimmer now and looks like my cheekbones here pop out a lot Right, and for the jawline, if you have um, a lot of fat down here and you want to want to have a sharper or more defined jawline, um, this is what you would be doing. All you need to do is use the same shade that you contour your cheeks with, and just go like right underneath your jawbone like this. And this will create the shadow to be right underneath it for a slimmer um, jawline effect like this another one also remember to um, go back and forth around this part right here because you want to create that really really slim um, jawbone way back here and you can see that it's really really defined make an angle back here ok 
Okay, same thing on the other side. Alright, now I'm done with my cheeks and my jawline. So what I'm gonna do next is my forehead. And for those who have a um, really big forehead and want to hide it, all you have to do is just use the same color and just put it right above here and down here, right around your face like this, and it it will create that um, shadow right around your forehead, and so the light will just shine to this part only and not back here. So that is how you will um make your forehead seem smaller and if you guys n want to know how to do this correctly here's a really quick tip of how to do it all you just to do have to do is do like a three like this a three like this you see that it's like a three like down the cheek and back to your ear and down to your jawline that's a really really quick easy way how do you can just contour your face a three here and now I'm done with my face and I'm gonna go uh, with my uh, nose and how to make your nose look slimmer and also um, to have a pointer or higher nose bridge and I'll be putting that right along right here and you can use any brush for that but I use the um, Revlon you can buy this brush at any targets or drugstore um, what you do is you use the same color and blow off or tab off the extra and all you do is look down like this and contour right along your nose like this and bring it back up all the way to your eyebrow and you can turn at an angle like this so you'll know where to go exactly just follow the line and blend it and you can use the lighter shade this one here to um make it and to blend it right in it so it won't look too harsh like blend it around right here, put it right here. Yep. Alright, and if this part of your nose is really big and you want to make it appear smaller, all you have to do is um, use a brush or you can use your pinky and dab in the same color. And all you do is to the side like this and go up like this and also if you want your nose to be more pointier all you do is put it right underneath right underneath here and now for your chin, if you have a really, really short chin and you want to make it longer, all you have to do is put the shadow right above your lips here. And if you have a really long chin and you want to create a shorter chin, all you do is put the um, shadow right right on here, this part here, where the light sh will shine to it and create a shadow right here. But I have a short chin, so what I will be doing is to um, make my chin to be longer so I'll place in shadow right underneath my lips like this and also by doing that 
it will make your lips a lot fuller. Just blend it back and forth like this, right underneath your lips. Yep, and now we're done for the contour, and we'll go and ahead and do the highlighting.